Hello everyone, Katie Freiling here, and I wanted to introduce you today to a concept called Blissipline. Now, Blissipline is a practice that when practiced daily and very intentionally, will not only create you an immense amount of material, physical wealth, but will also help you to be um, at peace and very internally fulfilled and blissful in your life. Because if you're watching this video here today, if you follow me at all, I'm pretty sure that you're somebody who doesn't want to just make a lot of money and be miserable, and you don't want to just you know sit around being happy all day and not have any material wealth either. You want to have the whole package, and it's completely understandable, and you can have it all with this practice called Blissipline, and it's actually very, very simple. Uh, it's a, a term and a concept that was actually introduced to me by a very, very good friend of mine um, over a dinner conversation recently. We were talking about business and success, and I loved the term so much that I wanted to come here and share it with all of you here today. So, Blissipline is really the synergy of two words, bliss and discipline. Now, as you know, entrepreneurs, marketers, business people, we hear about discipline quite a bit, right? We hear about self-discipline and the importance of, you know, creating goals, to-do lists, you know, taking action, making things happen, being disciplined with your time, your energy, all of these things. And they're very important. Having self-discipline is extremely important in creating material success. But it's not the whole picture. Because if your mind and your energy is so focused on just the discipline alone, you can actually miss the present moment. A lot of times, uh, people who are overly focused on just the discipline tend to use the present moment as a means to an end. As, you know, I gotta do this now so that I can make this next sale, or I can make this next million, or I can get this house, or whatever it is. And when you're living and operating that way, you're not um, you're not internally fulfilled or blissful at all because when you're living the present moment as a means to get to the next, you're always striving for more and you're never going to fully arrive. So discipline's important, but it's also important to uh, equally practice the principle of being in your bliss. So. Again, there's you know the opposite end of the spectrum of people who are overly focused on that and you know are poor, don't have the money to support themselves because they haven't practiced the discipline aspect. So it takes both. So what is the practice of bliss? It's very simple. It's being aware of the present moment. It's just being in the present moment. Simple as that. So. Again, when we're not in the present moment, we're either, you know, back in the past where we're analyzing things we've done or what other people have done or judging ourselves or other people or we're wishing things would have been different or we're just replaying it in our minds or we're clinging to the past because we want to be back there for some reason. Or we're in the future where we can't wait to get that next that next car or, you know, uh, make that next sale or get that next relationship and we miss out on the beauty of the present moment, and it's the present moment where your bliss actually lies. So if you can actually practice both on a daily basis, the practice of one, being in the present moment and enjoying the moment for what it is, not using it as a means to an end, but if you have a project that you have to do, and you have some you know, uh, to-do list of things you gotta do for the day, Take the time to really enjoy the journey. Enjoy each moment of you know working towards your goal, of um, you know really moving towards something, but enjoying the moment as you go. Okay, but then also having the discipline of yes, you have to be disciplined with your time. Yes, you have to make those to do lists. Yes, you have to take action. You have to get out there and really make things happen. And when you can do both when you can truly be in your bliss, be in the present moment, and also be a very self-disciplined human being, you have Blissipline, and it's a total formula for ultimate success in life. Okay, you got the material, and you also have the inner fulfillment and bliss with just being happy, being joyful in life. And so, 
Um, I have actually been very much practicing this in my own life and trying not to get too caught up on you know goals that are too far away or what I gotta do tomorrow or any of that stuff but just to, to be in my own schedule every day and to enjoy it moment by moment. Okay, so um, I'd like to, I'd love to encourage you all to also practice discipline. Whether you're working on your home business, you're, um, you know, you're an entrepreneur, or you have a job, you have kids, a family, whatever it is, in each moment, just keep grounding back to this practice of discipline and keep reminding yourself that this really is the formula to creating what you really want in life with the whole entire package. So please leave me a comment down below. I'd love, love, love to hear from you. Um, what do you think of discipline? Is this something that you've been practicing already? Is this something that you've been planning on practicing? And uh, always feel free to share this post with anybody that you would like to share it with. Uh, enjoy the rest of your day so very much, and I look forward to speaking with you again soon. Bye-bye.